Okay, time to unbox the stroller. I already started cutting. Now, I know I'm going to have to assemble this. Yes. Wow. It's kind of heavy, too. I'm pausing because I'm like, this doesn't quite look like the picture. But I hope this is a, the one I wanted. This looks like the second one. Oh boy, I'm gonna have to work with it. This looks like the second straw. We'll see. in pieces. It's in pieces. Okay. <sighs> I'm coming back to this. Okay, so I had to take it out the box without the camera. It was just too much. I thought it was going to fall. So this is the stroller. It does appear a little bit darker than the picture on the website. The website showed it like more cream. But that's okay because I'm going to decorate it. What I do like about it is that all of this is like that chrome silver which is going to look great with the uh, crystals I'm going to put on there. So, yeah, I knew it was going to be some assembly, you know, for this. So I have to put this together. I'm going to read the instructions. And that's really important because that's going to determine how I decorate it. This whole stroller will be pearl dazzled and blinged out. So I have to make sure when the stroller is closed that no crystals are in the way. So I have to figure out the design. So first I have to put it together. But I'm going to do that with the camera because that's not that serious. So here we go. That's the stroller. I will come back when it's put together. Stay tuned, guys. Hello, everyone. I'm Coco Sherelle, and this is my channel, Bling in Air. As you see, I have the stroller all put together, and it's really cute. But y'all already know, I'm about to turn it up 10 notches and completely transform it. If this is your first time to my channel, thank you for clicking on this video. And hopefully you like what you see and hit that like and subscribe button to be part of the Blink family. For my returning viewers and Blink family, it's always a pleasure to have you tune in. Now y'all don't forget to hit that like button also because you already know there's going to be another beauty. So if you would like to see how I transform this stroller, please keep watching. Step one in decorating the stroller is painting it. Yep, I said it. I will be painting this entire stroller. And look at me, I am hesitating. I am nervous because I know there's no turning back. As you see from the title, I will be using pearls and rhinestones to decorate the entire stroller. When I purchased the stroller online, the description said beige, but the picture showed cream. So I figured it could work. But from the unboxing, the stroller was a little darker than what I expected and I knew I would have to paint it in order for my design to look the way I wanted it to look and match the pearls. Right now, I'm using white fabric paint as the base and primer coat over the entire stroller. Once this completely dry, I will then apply a cream fabric paint as the final color. Look at the difference already from just the white paint. I know I made the right decision when I did this. So 
So now I will have to go in with the cream color over the entire stroller. I will not be doing the inside of it, just the outside. I bought two bottles of this cream color paint and I only used a bottle and a half for the entire stroller. I already started painting the top of the hood with the cream color and you can see the difference between the white and the cream. It looks amazing. I'm glad I went in with the white first because I know that the cream color will pop with a white base. Guys, I really can't believe I painted this stroller. I was so nervous, but I think it came out beautiful and this is just what I needed to ensure that the pearls will match. Now it's time to pearl dazzle this stroller from top to bottom. So go grab a drink of your choice, sit back, relax, and enjoy as I do what I do best. As usual, this process will be sped up because I value your time. I will pop in here and there if I need to explain something. Enjoy guys. All materials or at least something similar will be left in the description section below. Thank you.
Hey everyone, I hope y'all guys are still with me. Now don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button because I'm moving and grooving with this design. Look how well the pearls match the paint. This is why I did that guys. Oh, ciao. I'm almost done. I just had to pop in here, guys, just to show you where I'm at with the design. I am almost finished. It's been a long process. I don't even know what day I'm on. It's just long. As you see, I'm in my art studio. I had to move everything to the art studio. I've been working here for a while. But look at that. I just wanted to pop in and let you guys see, you know, 
where I'm at with the design. We're almost done, hang in there. I just got some small minor details to fix up. I'm gonna show you guys how I do that. And then we're gonna come in with the final result. Keep watching. Hey everyone, we have come to the end of the road with this design. I wanted to show you guys the very first look of the stroller. This is the second look when I painted everything. And now it's time for the final look. You ready? Let's see this. Here is the finished look. Oh my God. God, I am still pinching myself because I cannot believe I did this. This came out over the top amazing. <laughs> I designed this for a customer of mine. If you saw my last video, this is the same customer that I designed the car seat for with the pearls. And I said it has something else. This is the something else, the stroller. It is amazing. I know it's over the top and it's as glamorous, but this is what she wanted for her granddaughter. And I think it came out amazing. I did use um, some Mod Podge finishing spray to set everything. So I sprayed the whole entire um, outside of the stroller just to make sure that the paint, nothing's going to chip. So everything is going to set beautifully. Disclaimer, all embellishments was securely adhered on as seen in this video. But to ensure the safety of any baby inside, this was advised to only be used during the newborn infant stages. As discussed with the buyer, she will only be using this stroller for special occasions and events, as this is not the baby's main stroller. Thank you. I told y'all from my last video that this baby is going to be dripping in bling. Her grandma got her covered. Guys, this was a labor of love. I felt like I gave birth to this daggone stroller. It was a long process. I can't even tell you how long it took me to make this. I lost count of the days. Okay, Coco, enough about the long process. Y'all already get that part. <laughs> But I would like to know from you all, do y'all like this show as much as I do? Because I love it. It's so glam. It's so pretty. I would love to see this baby in a stroller. Hopefully the customer will send me some pictures. But I want to hear from you all. Would y'all use this stroller for the special baby in your life? For maybe a christening? How about a wedding? Or how about a photo shoot? That would be awesome. Leave your thoughts inside the comment section because I would love to know. Guys, you came so far in this video with me. Thank you so much. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, share it, and subscribe so you can see more of my Bling creations and become part of my Bling family. Now, y'all don't forget to also follow me on Instagram. My page is called Bling and Eric, just like this channel. 
Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, stay blessed. Bye, guys.